Hey everyone and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. On this video we're going to be completing our side quest, Shield or Blade. A dark shade stands at the gates of Tutankhamun's afterlife, bringing with it a poisonous corruption that will taint everything it touches. The blind oracle Nena begs Bayek to help her stop it and Bayek agrees, even if this means performing a sacrilegious ritual to destroy a man's soul forever. The reward for this one is 8500 experience and a legendary outfit, and we need to bring the ingredients to the oracle. And that is 455 meters away. I joined him in his tomb to serve him in the afterlife. He died too young, struck by the chariot's wheel. I often... Um... Okay. Not sure why that interrupted. Oh, look at this. I need that guy for a trophy I've been meaning to get. Um, so there's a trophy for killing a mummy with uh, fire. And I killed a bunch of these Anubis guys, and I could not figure out why it wasn't working. It's because they're not technically mummies. The big brutish guys are. So let's get him low health, and then we will switch to fire bombs. Alright, um, let's get him a little bit lower. A couple hits. Oh! That didn't feel good. Ugh! Alright. That should be good enough. Fire bomb! Doesn't do much. But, oh, I actually did it quite a bit. Alrighty. Well, trophy should be popping up. Um, trophy? Hmm. Oh, there we go. It's just delayed. Yep, all you have to do is kill one of those brutish guys with the firebomb, and you will get your trophy. Well, firebomb or anything with fire. So, like, oil jars, stuff like that. Oh, and let me, let me switch back to the sleep darts. Because in general, I do not like the firebombs. And sleep darts are ridiculously good. Alright, bring the ingredients to the oracle. The oracle is waiting near the entrance to the duat. Right here. I have the things for the ritual. But... Uh, is there no other way? To destroy a man's car is... Do you know how this one tricked Osiris? How they avoided the devourer, Amit? by using the heart of an innocent, a child. I do not have to tell you what that means, by Then let us begin. The warriors of the Jackal will try to stop us. Do not let them. Okay, defeat the warriors of the jackal. I invoke you, Lord of Silence. Give us your Heka and your Nechaka. I invoke you, Devourer, Soul Sucker, Punisher. For we seek to banish an unclean soul from this realm. May your name die. May your body decay. You shall be turned back from heaven and earth. Your soul will never stand before Osiris. Thy soul destroyed. Thy body destroyed. Thy car destroyed. I'm a party here and let his net. I'm a party here and let his net. I'm a party here and let his net. That didn't feel good. Understand. His guardians will not oppose us anymore. Anubis is angry. Still, they come. May you 
enter the afterlife with your enemy. No, you will not corrupt the field of reeds as you have corrupted me. Alpen, devour him. Come! These demons, the souls you take, they will not deny you passage. Be at peace. Your heart is heavy no more. Septimius. Quest completed, Shield of Blade. And we got the Servant of a Moon outfit. Take a look. An outfit worthy of the priests who devote their lives to the oh, yeah, to the Lord of Thieves. Thought I had the wrong one selected. So there we go. Interesting look. I'm typically not a fan of outfits that cover my face, but this one's kind of nifty. We'll use it for a little bit. All right. So we are done in this afterlife. Every location completed. All that remains are three locations in the real world. And uh, then we're completely done with this DLC. And there's one trophy that remains, but we will be picking up that trophy right at this location. We've discovered the spring of circuit. Mm, those guys are too close together. Let's take him down. His turn. See, these guys are high level. They're actually higher than me. Curve this around the post. is down there. We got a dude over there. There's another one. Still haven't found the captain. Senna can help me. There he is. Alright, and someone's sleeping in there. This place is heavily guarded. Not sure if I'll be able to one-shot this guy. Hey. Nope, not quite. Oh man, this tore him up. Alright. And for completing all five circuit locations, we get Circuit's Carapace, and we should be getting a trophy. There we go, Sting in the Tail. It's a gold trophy. And that is the final trophy for the DLC. I'll be showing my trophy collection after we finish the last two locations. So let's try out the new one, Circuit's Carapace. Goddess, you who protects from the skittering, slithering things. You who guards Ra on his night voyage. The world encircler holds no dominion over you. And I really like this outfit. I really like it. Although it makes us look like a bandit, I still like it. Alright, there's some civilians here. We can help them out. 
And hopefully they find their way home. Oh, and one guy remains. Let's take him down. All right, lady. Hope you can find your way home. The guards are dead. All right, moving on to this location. And I probably should have restocked, but oh well. him out a little bit. Oh, he saw me, but too late. Oh. Hello, peoples. Oh, no, you don't. Get away from that camp. I like you guys mounted. Stop blocking me. Nope, off of that. Alright, let's jump off. Hello! Alright, we're clear, and there's our treasure. Let's see, is there a quiver here? That sucks. Request for reinforcements. We need at least two more squadrons. The bandits are many, cunning and resourceful. We cannot defeat them without superior numbers. The merchants bitterly complain that their caravans are lost, sometimes as many as three in a week. Send word to whoever is now the general in Yebu. Without reinforcements, the oasis will be lost. All right. One final location. Whoa. All right, so the buried temple hideout has two treasures to find. Let's go find him. That was weird. It's on fire for a second. What? What? What do you want? Hey. I believe my treasure is back here. Yes. Alright, so there's the first treasure. The other one is closer to the entrance. I thought there was more enemies in here. Did I see someone sleeping? No. Oh, yes, I did. Alright, that might have been all of them. Pretty nice place they found here. Oh, hi. Alright, so we need to go into the well. And here is our second treasure. Uh, 
All right, location completed, and that is all of the locations in the DLC. I'm not gonna show each afterlife. They're done. Trust me, we've seen them. Um, but you can see all the locations here in the real world are completed. We do have some new gear. I will unhighlight that, and then we'll go check out the trophies. Now, um, there's only one thing in the game I have not done. Wait, was that? A... I thought I saw a legendary. Oh well. Um, so there's only one thing in the game I have not done, and that is the trial of Sobek, which just so happens to be active right now. So. We'll do our last video on the Trial of Sobek, and then Assassin's Creed Origins is completely done, 100%. Uh, so let's see, that's all done. Yep. All right, and I was gonna show the trophies. Let's do that. So we have 100% of the trophies. Trial of Sobek is not uh, tied to any trophy whatsoever. Let's see, 100% for all of the DLCs, and here is our newest one, The Curse of the Pharaohs. And 5% of the players ended up completing the main story of the DLC, which is pretty high for a second DLC. The Sting in the Tail is the... or no. Dark Horse is the rarest of the trophies, which is surprising. You just have to buy it. But only 2.3% did that. All right, and that brings my trophy rank up to 86% through rank 14, getting closer and closer to rank 15, and I will show you my entire trophy collection. For those of you that are interested. Alrighty, we are all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.